guys, it's B. Today I'm going to do something different that I've been very excited to do. Today I'm going to show off the Sailor Moon ColourPop collection. I have been so excited about this collection for ever since it first came out. I was unfortunately too slow to get it the first time it came around. And unfortunately by the time I did get to go on the website and look into it, everything, everything was sold out up until two weeks ago everything was sold out and they finally restocked it actually no it wasn't even two weeks ago oh my gosh it was like a week ago yeah up until a week ago it was out of stock and then they finally did a restock and they made a big deal about it and when i tell you that literally the website i thought the website was gonna crash because everything was going so slowly because of the immense amount of traffic that was coming in to buy this stuff i had five things in my cart and I was only able to buy three because as I was checking out, two of those items sold out. You would have thought it was the holidays or something, but no. It's makeup with Sailor Moon's face on it. <laughs> and like the shades are just references to the show or whatever. So like this was insane, but I'm very happy that I got it and I'm gonna show you how I got this whole look going on. So let's get started. Okay, so it came in a box like this, and while I was unfortunately unable to get everything that's part of this collection, I was able to get what I felt was the most important. So I got the eyeshadow palette and both lip gloss sets. The eyeshadow palette comes packaged like this, and it actually has all of the pigment things on the back. But look at how cute this packaging is alone. Oh my god, she's so cute. And then when you open it up, ah, oh my god, look how pretty! Oh my god, this is like the perfect like super girly like spring and summer palette that you could use. Like it's so fun looking and even look at these glitter shades, they're like so nice looking. And I love that all the pigment names are references to the shell. Like, Moon Castle and Luna and Tuxedo Rose and Justice and... Was that one Twilight Flash? Like, I love this. This is very cute. And now, these two lip gloss sets. One is called Daylight, which has Usagi, or Serena, in the dub, in her, you know, everyday school uniform with Luna. And then Moonlight has Usagi as Sailor Moon in her Seremu, or that's what it is, right? Seremu? No. Fuku? <laughs> it's her Fuku. Uh, her Sailor Fuku. Her uniform. Not her school uniform. Her Sailor Scout uniform. And it's so cute. And with the daylight shades, they are lighter. They're on the lighter side. This has like a peachy kind of color to it. This is a little more rosy. And the moonlight shades are a little bit darker. Yeah, they yeah they just like just like a slight bit darker. This one has like a dark, like a dark rose gold kind of color. I'm only saying rose gold because it has like the goldish, you know, tint to it. And this has like a fuchsia kind of color to it. I don't know. These are nice, and I'm really excited to try them. So, let's get started. Okay, now let's have some fun with this. I'm gonna go in with. Twilight Flash right here because that seems to be the most muted color and that's perfect for what I think. That's at least perfect for me for my crease color. And we're gonna kind of sweep that in there. This is just, you know, a non transition shade. Uh, I forgot the word for it. But anyway, we're just gonna kind of sweep that along the crease so that we kind of have a pretty solid foundation going on. Ooh. Wow, that has like a pinkish tint to it. It looks peachy. It looks peachy in the pan, but then when I put it on, it looks pinker. I like it. I like it very much. I'm gonna keep sweeping this into my crease until I'm like just, and just kind of bring it halfway up towards my eyebrow. I'm not a professional, people. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just having fun here. I'm having fun with Sailor Moon makeup, all right? I'm like eight years old right now. 
with the same brush because brush is brush, people. I'm gonna go in with, oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm gonna go in with Moon Castle because I usually do like a very um, everyday kind of look. Wait, hold on, this is not as muted as I thought. This is nice. I'm gonna sweep this into my crease as well so that it blends in with, was it Twilight Flash? I also like kind of brought it like halfway onto my lid from the outside, like from the outer corner. And I'm gonna kind of tap it, sweep it, whatever gets the color on there. It doesn't really matter to me. Wow, this is like nice. I really like this. Guys, I'm like obsessed with ColourPop lately, like m more than I thought I ever would be. All right, that looked good. So, what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna try to take one of these shimmery shades, either Silver Crystal, Silver Millennium, or Full Moon, and I'm gonna pack that onto the inner corner of my lid. So, um, I don't use a brush with shimmer shades, I use my finger, sorry guys. So I'm going to go in with, I think, Full Moon because I am liking the gold shades a lot and I feel like Silver Crystal might get lost. So I'm going to go in with Full Moon. <laughs> All right. I'm going to put that. Whoa. Whoa. Oh my God. These shimmer shades are unreal. Oh. <gasps> Whoa! Oh my god! Ah! And with the pinkish tint from Moon Castle? This is incredible! Oh my god! <laughs> I love everything about this! Wow! Money well spent. I love this! <laughs> now, with a, um, with a smaller brush that I have here. I am gonna go into Miracle Romance. And I'm gonna kinda pack that onto the outer corner. See where that takes me. It takes a little bit of work. It's very okay to me. I like that. That's really pink. Wow. Okay. So now that that's like kind of on there, I'm gonna go back into that first brush that I used and I'm gonna kind of like blend that out. Oh, that kind of disappears when you blend it out. Okay. Wait, no, it stays. Oh, it stays. Oh, oh, oh. All right, you know what? I'm gonna push it a little bit. I'm gonna go in with Luna and kind of try to, oh, oh, oh. I love it. Okay. So kind of Accent the outside there a little bit. Oh, oh my god! I'm gonna try. I'm I'm terrible with this. I'm gonna try to pack on as many of these pigments as I can. God, oh, I love this. I love this. I'm gonna try to get more of Miracle Romance on there to kind of give it a give it a little boost. Oh my god, this is unreal. Okay. What I do not like about this palette though, is that there seems to be a lack of a highlight shade, but that is okay. Like for like my brow bone and everything, that's fine. I'm gonna go in with Shining, oh. <laughs> I'm gonna go in with Shining Moon and just kind of shake that up there so that it doesn't look too bare up by my brows. Whoa. Okay, so now it's kind of hot guys so what I don't like to do is put eyeliner on that's when I do a smoky look so I'm gonna go back into moon castle actually no no don't listen to me I'm gonna go back into miracle romance and I'm gonna kind of sweep that under gotta dab that along with the outer corner up there and kind of sweep that under that under so I have the look of a sick Victorian child with the flu who won't make it through winter 
you know what this accidental gold on the inner corner over here not that terrible I might I'm gonna fix that with here there we go all right so now I'm gonna go back into moon castle and I'm gonna buff out how to give it a less abrasive look oh, that's nice. oh my god all right so now that's done and I'm gonna slap on some mascara with my Tarte Men Eater mascara. This is my favorite mascara because the bristles on the wand are like super super short so they don't completely clump up my eyelashes. Ah! But you are putting it directly in your eyeball if you're like me. Okay. Alright! Moving on to our lip glosses. I don't know which one to use. All right, so definitely not gonna go with the blotted lips because I feel like my eye look is already like loud enough that I kind of need something a little more muted. So it's a toss up between these ultra glossy lips. So it's either Moon Tiara or Sailor Moon. <laughs> That's cute. I am gonna go with I'm gonna try Moon Tiara and see where that takes me because that has that peachy kind of look but it also has like the gold shimmery tones in there. So we're gonna see how this looks. Oh, that's a different kind of applicator. Oh, it's a brush. It's like a paintbrush almost. Okay, it feels really weird when you first put it on but I'm okay with it. This is like strange to put on. Were these supposed to like go together? <laughs> Were you supposed to put the one on and put the other one on on top of it? Is that how that works? This looks nice though. Like once you actually like, get it on and stuff, it like, kind of looks nice. I feel like it kind of like clumps up there like in your lip if you put too much on. Hmm. Okay. So, this actually looks, this actually looks really decent. I like it. So, like I said, I was unable to get all of everything. So my blush is going to be the Papa Don't Peach blush by Too Faced. <laughs> I mean, it works. But, you know oh my god it's been so guys it's been like a really long time since I was able to actually put blush on my face because you know with what's going on right now uh, to wear a mask and everything and it, I don't want all of my blush going on to my mask or anything oh and for my highlighter I'm gonna go in with this glow pro stellar iridescent highlight in the shade Nebula by City Color. I got this in an Ipsy bag. I don't know anything about this brand. I'm gonna sweep that up here. Because it has like a bluish tint to it, so I feel like it's very, very appropriate for this. Oh, wow. I don't remember it looking like this. It has like purples in it too. Wow. That's pretty. This is so cute! Oh my god, I love this! Wow, I'm like really impressed by this. Listen, guys, given that I'm not a pro, like, if I can use this, you can too. It also does help like watching makeup peoples on YouTube and everything. Like, I actually learned some of my techniques I learned from uh, Nikki tutorials, so yeah, so she's been very helpful with me improving my makeup skills and everything. So I really appreciate her content and everything, and she's very fun to watch. So, if you guys would like to see me review any other makeup lines or anything like that, um, I could try that. I could definitely try that. I know that this is new and everything, like, I had never done this before on my channel, so. 
this has been a very different experience. This is a very different way of filming than I'm used to, but I had a really good time and I'm pretty sure all of my very real, very real reactions um, were very entertaining and I hope that you were entertained by them. Okay, and if you like to see me do any other kind of like, you know, not baking videos where I just like review like other things that you can find, that you can buy. If you want to see me do any other looks with this too. Um, if you want to see me use the darker glosses that come with the collection. Guys, I'll do anything with this makeup. If it gives me an excuse to use this makeup on my channel again, 100% I will. I'll do it. Also, don't forget to give this video a like, subscribe to my channel, and follow me on Facebook, Tumblr, Twitter, and Instagram. Okay? 